my Guan Bin Boy, and welcome to Italy versus Austria at Wembley Stadium for Euro 2020. Yes! Yes guys, good afternoon and welcome. We are here at High Wycombe Station. I have already done the drive down and today we are going to Euro 2020 round of 16, Italy versus Austria. Now the Italians have looked absolutely amazing in the group stage. Austria squeaked through, uh, but managed to get runners up. Uh, it's gonna be a really, really interesting game. I'm really excited for this one. Anyway, we are heading into London now. Let's get on the train and let's get back to Wembley again. back at Webley. It is the second game in only a matter of days. We are back for Italy versus Austria. It's now the crunch time of Euro 2020. It is the round of 16. I believe Italy are going to win today, but this is like Austria's World Cup final. They've never got this far. I just don't count them out. But uh, we're going to head to the fan shop. I'm going to grab myself an Italy t-shirt so at least I can rep one of the teams today. And yeah, we're back in level two where we were with Yaz for the Croatia game and I'm very excited to get back in my leather seat. So yeah, let's head to the fan shop. Never gets old being at Wembley, does it? It's a beauty. That is the famous crossbar from the 1966 World Cup final between England and Germany here at Wembley. Oof. It looks rusty and old. <laughs> Back in hospitality, very cheeky. Italy top secured. She had to go into the back and get me a medium, but we got it. We also got a scarf and a replica trophy, so that's pretty good. Unreal view, dead excited for this game now. What an absolutely unreal view this is. Whoa, we've hit the bid time with these ones. Okay, teams are in. Italy have changed it up completely for the game against Wales. They are back to the side that played against Switzerland. The only exception is Giorgio Cellini is not in the match day squad. Austria are completely unchanged from that win against Ukraine in the final group game. Whoa, this is gonna be an exciting game. Right, let's go to the pre-match ceremony for Italy versus Austria at Wembley Stadium, last 16 game. We've got some Italians in our block. I'm gonna fit right in. <laughs> also, before the ceremony starts, I'm gonna give my quick score predictions. I'm going with an Italy win. I think they're too strong for Austria. I think Austria have done amazing to get this far, but Italy have been so impressive over the course of the tournament. So I'm going Italy three, Austria nil. There's my prediction. Okay, here we go. Pre-match ceremony, Italy versus Austria. Wembley Stadium, round of 16. I'm so excited. Let's go. Today, usually for the England game, everyone was singing and roaring them on. Today, everyone's just dancing and having fun, and it's brilliant to watch. As a neutral, I'm absolutely loving it. But I want Italy to win today, but everyone's just dancing, it's fantastic. Ceremony was brilliant as normal. Let's get the teams out.
absolutely shattered the Austrians in terms of attendance. The atmosphere for the Italians is unbelievable. Wow, what a game we're going to have here. I tell you now, these Italian players and the fans are up for it. Oh, it's brilliant to be a neutral. of minutes, Austria win the ball back from Italy losing it. <laughs> they had a chance, you know. Uh, they started the game quite well. They're pressing Italy quite high. They're allowing them to have possession, but they're pressing them quite high. They look up for this. I did say they would. Nil-nil. Yes. Oh! Great He's very quick. You'd think for a boost as loud as this, someone's injured or time-wasting. Nope, this is Austria having possession. Bit hostile. Yes! Oh, what a save! Oh. Goalkeeper just pulled off a big save there. They're getting closer, the Italians. And they know it as well, they're getting closer. What an effort from Immobile. It didn't look like from up here he hit the post, but he did. He hit the crossbar, the cross between the post and the bar. Uh, Italy getting closer, but they're finding Austria's defence really hard to break down right now. Austria doing themselves proud at the moment, and they look dangerous on the counter with that Anatovic chance. So, you never know. I don't know which way this is going to go, actually. Don't know. There's half time. Okay, so it's half time and it is Italy nil, Austria nil. As expected, an extremely close game between these two. Italy bossing the possession, they've had the better chances arguably, but they just can't break that Austrian defence down. And when Austria get a bit of room, they decide to go on the counter attack and Arnautovic had a big, big chance to maybe hit the target. Uh, that's Italy's best chance of scoring in the second half down the left hand side. They've been very good. Uh, they had a bit of a set piece on the half time and Acherbi headed it wide. Uh, but other than that, Italy really, really haven't troubled the Austrian goalkeeper. It's a game of few chances, but Italy have had the better chances uh, that have fell their way. I believe my 3-0 score prediction at the start was very optimistic. I can see one goal win in this game, and Austria need to score first, because if Italy score that first goal, I think that'll be it. They're the kings of defence, and I think that'll be it. Austria won't be able to get themselves back in it. So Austria need to score that first goal to have any chance of getting through this game. It is there for Austria to maybe get a result here. It's not completely gone. Uh, anyone has got a chance in these later stages. It is a cup competition at the end of the day. And yeah, half time, nil nil. Let's get to the second half. Italy versus Austria at Wembley Stadium. Let's go, second half. Let's have a good game. Let's see who's gonna make the next round. Shock of the Euros incoming. Wow. I got a minute. I got a minute. I got a minute. There is going to be a big roar if this gets disallowed. VAR are currently checking the goal. Not too sure what for. It's just come through on the screen. All eyes on the referee now. It's offside. It's not counting. Italy's Just scored! Oh, 
offside on our bench. Wow! Everyone is at the seat of the Italian end. Wow! Nil nil still. Extra time. Ooh. Interesting. Mancini masterclass, both the subs have scored. We still love you Mancini, we miss you. Now time in extra time, it's here, surely done it now. Mancini, whoa, Mancini, whoa. He comes from Italy to manage Man City. We love Mancini. They're in, surely, surely. I stopped it, what a chance. Keep going, keep going, keep going. Imagine. Brilliant run. Score that. What a chance. Oh, he's missed. Oh, he's missed. Oh, he's gone in. Oh, he's gone in. They have a chance. Oh, he's gone in. Back to the middle we go and we've got a game. We've got a big seven minutes. The goal's been coming, that goal has been coming as well. They've been looking dangerous ever since Italy scored that second. They've not given up. I'm not sure whether it went directly in off the corner or an Italy or an Austria player got in touch, but that's a big goal and we've got a big six minutes. Ooh, this could go to penalties. Don't rule anything out. Four minutes of extra time to go. 2-1, Austria just need to go for it. And oh, the Italians around us are very, very nervous. He's gonna hit it. Oh! Two minutes to go. Italians, hold your breath. Good ball. Can you wrap it up? He's round the keeper. Oh, it's going to fly. Inches from wrapping it up. And that's it. Italy is through. Relief. Around Wembley. Done it. Just relief around Wembley. Italy are through to the quarterfinals, but they did it the hard way. They did it the Italian way. Brilliant performance in extra time by Italy. Absolutely brilliant. Austria gave it everything they got, just a little bit short. But fair play to Austria, giving it everything they have. Well done, Italy. Congratulations. We'll see you in the quarters. is going to bring an end to the vlog. Congratulations to Italy. They are through to the quarterfinals. The 90 minutes was okay. Austria were brilliant in the 90 minutes, but Italy showed up in extra time to secure the win and secure themselves in the quarterfinals of Euro 2020. Hope you have enjoyed the vlog. Make sure to smash a like and subscribe down below for more Euro 2020 adventures at Wembley and beyond. And we see you guys next time. Peace out from Wembley.